what's going on guys welcome back to another video and um all right another atomica limited vintage uh, this was a release from a couple months ago again um and uh, they're not quite new but i've had them for a while now just been super lagging on the review but here it is and uh i'm gonna review these four in one video uh if you're not interested in all of them then well you can just skip around uh you know skip to the one that you want to watch and enjoy and here's our first one that we're going to review no particular order it just happened to be the one that i didn't remove from the from the desk but here it is right super awesome little truck i am super excited about this one um let's zoom in a little bit so we can enjoy more of those details we got the dodson 1300 i think that's what it says whoa very cool keyhole door handle you know you got everything that you expect there's the um you fill up the gas the wheels look good it's pretty cool. what is that down there is that like a stain nope it's not a stain it's part of the car I don't know what it is. All right, the wheels look good. I am missing a little bit of the um, chrome right there and right there. So that's kind of interesting. Um, nice front with the headlights, the separate bumper, very cool detail. And the same on this side. So I think that's a side blinker right there, or a little marker. We got the bumper on the back, which is really cool too. Painted tail lights, Dodson. And this is the coolest thing about this. Well, it's not the coolest thing, but it's very cool. Removal. How's that look? Not bad, rolls perfectly. Super cool detail down there. Nice, Dodson. Sweet, sweet little casting. Like it. I like, like this better. It looks so much better. All right, let's put this to the side. Let's move on to the next one. This is a uh, Nissan Laro Metalist Club L. Uh, so this is a 1989 model. You can always uh, see that right there. So 1989 model. Let's enjoy this bad boy right here. Now, I wish I had bought the black one instead. I do like this a lot, but I think I saw a video, someone was showing the black one, and it just looks so much better. But this one, you can definitely see the interior. Look at that, it looks so cool. Stick shift, look at that, mm -hmm. super awesome. Or maybe automatic, I have no idea. But just this one, this one is definitely Check out the exhaust right there. This one's definitely um, a nice solid casting. Oh yeah, oops, there you go. The wheels look really good. They went all out on this one. This is definitely worth it. It's 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 heavier than the truck. I love the headlights, it looks so cool. Um, what does that say right there? Laurel, I think, club, no it says club. Club L, super awesome. What's that in the back? Laurel, Metalist, sweet. I like this, this is a really nice color wave actually. Um, I'm actually, it's starting to grow on me a little bit more, especially because the interior is so visible. Uh, I like this like creamy sort of a, does it say the color? It doesn't say the color. Anyways, let's move on and here we've got a 1998 Toyota Chaser 3.0 Advantage G. So, oh, check it out. You got a little separate piece to install on the roof, um, the rooftop here with the. Uh, Moon roof or sunroof. Very awesome. 
suspension. The front doesn't really travel that much. Not a lot of suspension travel. The rear has a little bit more. That's really cool. You got a little bit of a mud flaps right there. It's a nice touch. Now this color looks really good. I like this a lot. The interior quite visible. So that's, that's a plus. I love how... I mean, because their interiors, uh, Atomic Limited Vintage does great interiors, but it's just, they're not detailed to their maximum capacity. Like, you can definitely get in there and detail that thing so much more. But this is really good. Door handles look great. Door lines, headlights, that looks really, it looks like Lexus. Wow, look at those headlights. This looks like a Lexus. I think this this is the counterpart of the Lexus, if I'm not mistaken. Toyota, super awesome. This looks fancy. Look at that exhaust, tail lights, awesome. The wheels look really good. They went all out on this one too. And you know what? I think I missed out on their Chaser, their uh, the first Lexus that they released. Yeah, I definitely missed out. And I saw it on eBay. It was like, you got the. I forgot but you got the uh, mirrors installed on these two so that's that's very cool yeah talking about that chaser that i missed out on oh man that, that thing went up like it was going i mean back when i checked it was going for like 30 dollars on ebay i haven't checked now but i'm pretty sure it's a lot more expensive now anyways moving on to our last one of the video but that doesn't mean it's the least or the worst or whatever it's it's uh this is a 180 sx type 2 nissan this is a 90, 1991 you can always check for that and beautiful car beautiful car especially in black i didn't go for the white one because the white one showed so much of the gap uh, with with a wheel well but this one just kind of covers it up because it's all black so I like this a lot better uh, they are re-releasing this in a few more color waves but this is insane the wheels look really good this is awesome I like this this I like I like how um, Atomic Limited Vintage they're they're kind of expanding into like the 90s uh, era of of Japanese cars, which is really cool, because that's that's kind of like what I grew up seeing on the streets. You know, as a kid, I remember even in high school, like kids were, would drive this thing around. You know, uh, there was a kid who had a 180SX, and at the time, I thought it was super ugly. <laughs> but now, now it's like I hope he never sold it. You know, I hope he kept it. And I do have a little bit of imperfections here at the rooftop which is uncool but i think that was done from the package anyways no lens detail for the headlight but for the tail light you got this huge lens and uh, eh, kind of a simplistic on the uh, exhaust but it's there and there's my baby who just woke up um I have them right here next to me, which uh, I'm gonna cut this video a little bit short. Uh, we're gonna end this video. Let me know what you thought about these four castings and which one would you go for? I definitely would say these three right here are top <laughs> premium. The truck, you can definitely perhaps pass on it, but if you're into trucks, that's, that's the way to go. Thank you for watching. I'll see you on the next one. Bye.